when you watch that first episode, you're like, okay, no, this is extremely well made. It is, it's a, it's a very well made show. The Wire, greatest TV show of all time, Sopranos, Bordock Empire, Game of Thrones, up until maybe the sixth or seventh season, because after that it became garbage. HBO has a very good batting average. So if you want a show to be done good, or if you want an adaptation to be done good, probably should go to HBO. And I think that is just what the the, the length with them. Um, Doing it with your boys, Last of Us. So, now, I only played... Did I, did I even play a third? I mean, I played even less than a third of the game. Because remember, I, a friend lent me the game when I had my PS3. But I think something happened and I had to like, go somewhere or do something. And I didn't end up finishing it. So, I should have played like the, the beginning, bit, bit of the whole game. And I, and I wanted to play the game again. I was like, okay, let me play the game before the show. 16, really? 16 pounds on PS... I think the PS store something sixteen pounds. Now nah, relax. <laughs> I'd rather play thirty one pounds for No Man's Sky, which is freaking amazing, and I've been obsessed with that right now. Than that's what nah, nah, it ain't happening, bro. And um, pretty good episode. Look, that intro, that intro. I can't think of an HBO show that has had a crazier intro than that because. You know it's good way. Look, I've I you don't know, I've watched I watch films on loop, so I have seen a lot of films and a lot of films that have depicted like end of the world and apocalypse stuff. So I've watched films since I was five or six. It's not that it's like the best done, but in terms of me feeling of like man, what I do in that situation, and just the desperation of the situation, and I think that's why it's so crazy when you do these adaptations. Because look. Anybody who knows, there's a game called Legacy of King Soul River, which for me has the I don't I don't give a damn. It is the best story in any video game. Soul River One or Soul River Two has the best story in any video game ever. But I think there's some video games where you no, know, the whole point of this is the experience of a video game. Uncharted is a poor man's The Mummy and a starving man's Indiana Jones. I don't need to see a film of Uncharted. That's why that film that came out was complete trash. Um. But with this one, though, it's like, at, at first I was like, okay, why do you need to do it? Because the whole point is you can't have the same experience of you playing the video game of Last of Us. But it's HBO. And Pedro Pascal is a damn good actor, bro. This guy is a really good actor. <laughs> you know, like this guy doesn't miss. Pedro Pascal just doesn't miss. And when you just see that intro on this episode, but specifically that intro, you're like, okay, I know that it's not the same as playing the game, but bro... Cause let's let's now let's just keep it a stack. Let's keep keep it a stack. Okay, and this way we just need, need need to be real. Video game writers are not as good as the kind of writers we'll get on HBO. Now, not all writers in Hollywood are good because you know there's some trash that comes out of Hollywood. But if you're dealing with HBO, that's a tool that has gave us The Wire, that gave us Bordock Empire, and gave us um, Soul Sopranos, just, just those three. So give my friends back to one second because that's an, an, an adaptation. The Wire. Um, Sopranos and Borok Empire. These are three of the best written TV shows ever. Forget that. These are three. No, sorry. The th The Wire, Borok Empire, and Sopranos are three of the best written pieces of media, movies, or TV you'll, you'll ever ever watch. I would argue that you'll you'll find this hard to find a better writing than, than The Wire. I I don't. I've never seen a film or a TV show better written. With more layers than the Y, which is which is just like, like a book. So HBO have a very high bar. It ain't the same of those bombs who made on Uncharted or those bombs who made Assassin's Creed or, or those bombs who make a lot of these video game adaptations that are, that are trash. So it's in very capable hands. And H HBO, because they've delivered some of the best TV shows of all time, they know that okay, Last of Us is a very expensive video game. So we need to really put up our, our A game here. And when you watch that first episode, you're like, okay, no, this is extremely well made. It is it's a, it's a very well made show. And in terms of just putting you in on the of the action and so forth, man, I'm in. I'm in. But that intro, like when that plane crashed, I was like, 
oh wow okay things things are real now things are real now so you see for me my thing though is it's it's done so well this intro because our thing is still that if let's say it was a bit tricky and on off i'm like you know what let me just go out and just pay 16 pounds for the video game but now that i've seen this premiere episode i'm like screw it let me just walk let me just watch it here let me just watch it here you know and just see um how this goes without actually playing the the video game you know so because one thing i remember of the video game was i think this is it again that intro was crazy like when you just see what happens to joel and, and his daughter and so forth i remember saying oh, damn <laughs> That's because I was not expecting that. I was like, that's a crazy intro. <laughs> that, that's a crazy bit to intro if you're a video game man. But yeah, look, man, me tell me guys what you you think, man. But for me, man, um very well made. Very well made. And again, Pedro Pascal is a damn good actor, man. The guys are just a damn good actor. Like they and like he and you know they did a side by side. He looks a lot like your boy Joe, you know. So um and also I heard, I heard a lot of bad things about Last of Us too. And at, at the same time, bro. I am obsessed, bro. Right now, I'm in space. <laughs> right now, I'm a space merchant with No Man's Sky. So, I have no time to play any other game apart from No Man's Sky. So, that's what I'm playing right now on the Switch. But, yeah, tell me, guys, what do you think of The Last of Us premiere?